Welcome back everyone and thanks for joining us once again to another Guzman Boars and Angus video. Today's video, we're going to do a quick update on these two Dapple Dolings. If you guys have been following our channel, you guys saw when these two Dolings were born here on our farm approximately two months ago. So we're going to do a quick update on them. But before we, do, before we get into it, I do want to say if you guys enjoy these types of videos, you guys like the boar goat content, please hit that subscribe button. Uh, hit the like button on this video and comment down below what type of videos you, like, you guys would like to see going forward. But let's get into it. Uh, these two dolings are approximately nine weeks, so just over two months. If you guys uh, have been following my, my channel, you guys know I do like to wean my does or my kids at approximately three months. Uh, but the way these girls are going, uh, if you take a listen here, you can see just how much milk they're still intaking. It's incredible to see um, this doe has, has been a great producer. So she consistently has a lot of milk. We are in a drought here, uh, here in central California area. So we're on a drought. I have been supplementing her with feed, obviously because you can see there's there's no grass. So she has been, in, she has been uh, taking hay as well as uh, goat grain. But the amount of milk she's been producing, these two dolings are gonna be great growers so I, I am going to leave these two dolings behind so normally i wean my my kids at approximately three months because they will be introduced into my breeding my personal breeding program i'm going to leave them a little bit maybe a week or two uh, over those three months so maybe about 14 14 or so weeks then i'll go ahead and i'll pull them but um as you can see they come from great genetics uh, i did purchase this doe bread so these two dolings are unrelated to any of my bucks. So uh, I never like to uh, line breed or, you know, kind of uh, produce closely related kits together. So because these two does are um, sired by, a, by a, a solid black buck that is not related to any of my does, these two dolings are the perfect candidates uh, to, to keep and, and produce and, and uh, add to my breeding program. So you can see, not only are they growing nice and wide, you can see this this black dapple specifically, she is filling out really nicely. They have great uh, color genetics. So uh, both of these two both of these two dolings can either produce brown dapple or black dapple because their their dad is uh, a, a solid black buck. But with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys like these types of updates. I will be I will be keeping you guys posted on these two dolings as well as the rest of my herd. So if you guys want to want to stay posted, please hit that subscribe button. And then I try to produce new videos once a week. So hopefully you guys enjoy these contents. Comment down below if you guys want, want a specific type of video. And with that being said, thank you guys for watching. And don't forget to check out our website, GuzmanBoarsAndAngus.com.